All right, we are back again. Uh, I want to first off say thank you, everybody. Uh, it's my I'm not really a social media crazy person, and uh, I started my YouTube channel yesterday. And so far, everyone that's been following me or watching me do stupid things with food, uh, it's been insanely awesome. The support has been great, way more than I expected. And I feel like because of that, I'm gonna have more of you trying to kill me once again. Like my friend Josh Fisher from Hellforge Tactical uh, out in Sierra Vista, Arizona, I got a new mystery to attack myself with. Uh, one of the things I've been doing lately, anyone that sends me something, please don't tell me what you're sending me ahead of time because it's a mystery to me. So I like, to, I like to not know what the heck I'm getting myself into. So even this, I've never heard of a VAT-19. Uh, I hope it's a delicious, terrible thing, VAT-19. But uh, so let's see what the heck we're getting ourselves into today. and heavy it's a moisture pack that's a good sign all right so we have the vet 19 World's hottest chocolate bar, the Hellfire infused milk chocolate. This is a 12 piece chocolate bar. It is extremely spicy. Wow. All right. I'm not sure. I'll have to do some, some digging. I'm not positive yet if, if there's a, if there's a challenge involved with this, but later this afternoon, when I go about this, I will make sure that there is a challenge involved and we will see where this takes us. All right, once again, thank you, Josh, I think. <laughs> Love you guys and be decent. All right, well, like we said this morning, I came back to do this. Uh, for all those of you who missed it, this is the VAT-19, the world's hottest chocolate bar. Uh, I told, said this morning they didn't have a challenge on the box. So I went online and did some research and found that there is a challenge. So the challenge is there are 12 little pieces of candy, or pieces of chocolate, like little squares, like a normal chocolate bar. And every 60 seconds, you have to eat another one. Uh, one of the things that I normally never do, or try not to, is watch some of these challenges prior to me doing them so I don't scare myself. Wow. All right, well, this is a little melted, so I don't know how I'm going to do. Uh, so I was, I'm just gonna cut it into 12 little small pieces and hope for the best. It's uh, so one of the things that I also learned about this today, watching these videos. Uh, that's gonna kill later. So these, one of the reasons I've watched, I, I found out about these videos that people don't finish this challenge too often is because everything I've done so far has had the actual pepper itself in as a, as a in some form of powder normally. Uh, this one, it doesn't even state which pepper is being used. It just says that there's nine million Scoville extract all put into all of this wonderful little bit of chocolate business going on here and I'm pretty sure the extract is all over my fingers even though the warning says to wear gloves so starting off on a good note uh, I'm gonna try to do I don't know if I'm gonna cut it into 12 pieces because it's kind of weird shaped now All right, well, it's gonna be 12 pieces, but they're all gonna be randomly sized because <laughs> I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a mathematician over here. And there's, <clears throat> so 
like close enough to this as you guys can see. So we have all of these little guys. We got one that's got a little hole in it, but to make up for that one, I will, I will lick the rest of that chocolate off of there if I can make it that far. Uh, see, one of the things I also didn't plan, you got a, you got a timer for I can use real quick for it? All right, so yeah, and I, I, like I said, once again, the reason I don't watch these videos is because I don't like to psych myself out over stuff. All the good videos, I just like, I watch something and people pass and they kill it. And I'm like, oh, no problem. Well, this video, I never saw one person actually finish this challenge. So, super stoked. I got uh, all kinds of uh, all positive thoughts. But once again, thank you, Josh Fisher uh, and Hellforge Tactical. Uh, I hope the only thing hotter than this are the prices on them guns. But let's get let's go ahead and get started. Let me know when the timer starts, so we'll get this thing going on. Go. All right. <laughs> this is gonna fucking suck. Sorry. So, uh, most of the challenges we do, what I've done, minus this little crazy gummy bear, the heat kind of like. You get a second of time before it actually kills you. This stuff, the chocolate tastes really good actually, but as soon as that stuff touches your mouth, it goes into overdrive, and it's still building. It's giving me the shakes already. You know, getting a little, getting a little wet in the cheeks here. What's the more like that? Like, all right. Yeah, well, dang, my, fuck, my feet are sweating already. <laughs> this, is, this is freaking terrible, man. Oh, oh, goodness gracious. All right, we're about to get to the next one. We got a little bigger one so I can see if I can get this done faster. And go. And I don't know if it's just the El Paso heat, but this stuff melts right in your mouth. It's, it sucks. Ah, it's, <laughs> it's, it's really good chocolate. Oh. So I can go ahead and read the, the ingredients while I'm trying to get my mind off of this real fast. You know, brown sugar, cocoa, butter, whole milk, chocolate, liqueur. Okay. Sunflower, some other word I can't pronounce. Vanilla milk and 9 million <clears throat> Scoville chili extract. Ah, like the, oh goodness gracious. I think every part of me is sweating right now. Ugh. Five seconds. Five seconds. Moving on to the next one. Go. <laughs> mm. That was a little thicker and harder. It didn't really melt right away. So I watched, like I said, I watched a bunch of videos of these guys doing this. And everyone probably looked exactly how I look or feel when they're getting here. Ah, oh, yeah, it's uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, I'm gonna reiterate from earlier when I when I opened this up. I just want to say thank you to everybody who loves slash hates me and keeps on sending me crazy <sighs> stuff that makes my breathing hard. <laughs> Jeez. Ah, 10 seconds. 10 seconds, and that was number two or three? Oh, um, this is gonna be number four. All right, moving on to number four. Go. Oh, goodness. It's weird thinking that like these little tiny things have so much effect. Because if you would've just showed me this little tiny candy bar thing, Without having any idea, and you had told me the story behind it, I probably would have called you a liar. And, and I would have been the smart person that I am, and I would have ate that whole thing in a bite just to say you were wrong, and I would have probably died. <laughs> oh, it's just really crazy to me that this quarter inch, maybe by quarter inch little piece of chocolate is putting me through. Oh. Ah, oh, 10 seconds, we're going for the next one. Going on to number five. Oh my goodness. Go. 
right. So the videos I've watched, I'm not trying to gloat or say I could be better than anybody, but I didn't see anybody finish it. I only watched a couple of the, couple of the videos, but out of the videos I did watch, <clears throat> Number six was the highest I saw. Once again, there's probably a lot more videos than six videos out there, or seven or whatever number I watched, but I'm gonna do better than what I watched today and hopefully I can keep it going so I can entertain you while I'm slowly killing myself. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's 10 seconds. <clears throat> Going for the halfway marker. Go. It's really strange because the chocolate is delicious. It's got a good, it's like not over the top sweet. Oh. I'm really glad that I did this now versus this morning when I opened it up. Cause I didn't, I didn't go grocery shopping today. And I realized that I had zero milk, I didn't have any bread, I had nothing that was going to save me. I had a, maybe a beer or two in the fridge that obviously that'll make it a lot better, yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, my feet are right, just sweating across the ground. <laughs> oh, and I'm drooling on the, on the, on the, drooling on the table. Ten seconds. All right, breaking the record that I've seen once again. I don't. I'm. I'm, I'm positive people will finish this. I just haven't seen anybody. All right, I'm over the halfway mark. Oh man. So uh, recently opening this YouTube channel, I'm gonna try to spit out some of the information that I'm trying to get to if I can even talk right. So I'm loving all of these spicy food challenges. They're great. Uh, but I think one thing I haven't really seen too much on YouTube was not even just spicy food challenge, but random weird food challenges. I don't have any to, I can think of in my mind right now because it's still somewhere else. But if you want if anyone wants to see me do something crazy that has nothing to do with spice, I'm all for it. I'm sure I got some of my family members, mainly, this, my, mainly my brother over here, that would get involved in some of that stuff. Yeah. <sighs> ah. Ah. Down to the final four. <laughs> oh, shoot. Another thing. Um, if you find something crazy and there's not a challenge that's already with it, but you just want to see me and my friends and family eat, do stupid stuff on it, feel free to shoot it my way and put your own challenge with it. If it's something acceptable, I'm totally down for it. One of our friends said that she was going to give me a whole like 12 ounce jar of Reaper puree and if she was like, hey, here's Reaper puree, here's 12 ounces of it, I need you to eat the whole jar, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> uh, but if it's something crazy and you find it, we'll do it. Uh, down to the bottom three. After the last one, do you have to hold it a minute? I don't know. <laughs> Just to be safe. After the last one, I'll keep it, I'll, I'll stick around for a little bit and hang out. I'm not sure. Oh, that's pretty rough. I hope it's not a, oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> no, the burps make it worse somehow because all it comes back up and it just lets you know that your throat's still part of your body and it's on fire. Oh man. So this, it came from that nine. I heard also from, it might be from uh, Flamethrower Candy Company also, I'm not sure. <sighs> <laughs> Eat. 
either way, uh, they make some great products that you'll hate to use yourself and that you'll love to give to your enemies. <laughs> or family. Or family, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Family, yeah. It's great. Some of you don't, some of you got too many family members and you need to get rid of a couple. This is the best way to do it. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Home stretch, got two left. I'm saving the holy one for the end just so I can get a little bit of the. Uh, lick the rest of this craziness. <clears throat> Josh, you said you felt bad about the those cheese balls, man. That you overdid yourself. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Every I came up, I came up with something else, Josh, just for you. I got about maybe five, ten of these cheese balls left. I'm just gonna do a handful of cheese balls for you. And I also found out towards the bottom of the bag, they get way worse than when we started. I don't know if they're this bad, but. Oh, shoot. I should have used a tissue, but I'm gonna hold out. Oh my gosh. I'm drooling on myself again. Uh, holy cow. Where are we at? Five seconds. Five seconds for the oh, I smashed it. I'm like shaking. I can't even hold it straight. So I smashed the holy cheese. Holy cheese. Holy <laughs> holy <laughs> holy <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing my mind here. All right. And you get the whole little before. And oh, that is. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry, yeah. Appreciate it. Once again, family that cares. Make sure you clean up everything. Ah. Oh. Alright, so one minute to now would be full forty five. Oh goodness gracious. <laughs> I'm not sure how long. There's a little bit on chocolate on here. Man, I just look like a gangster, just like a pirate. Ah. Oh. I say chocolate's bad for dogs, and Vat 19 showed that it's freaking bad for everyone in the world. Oh, God. I'm not... I'm not sure how long I could go. I have to go before I can use anything. Uh, I can t I can tell you that the whole minute between them isn't enough to stop to calm the the fire down. Uh, oh goodness! Uh, it's super fun. I uh, I recommend this to all your friends and family. Uh, one minute pass. All right, one minute pass. I think I'm gonna do that one more minute, and then we're gonna call it quits, and then uh, I'm gonna drown my sorrow in a gallon of milk. Uh, my nose is dripping all over the table. Uh, Whoo! Yeah, that sucks. That's that's that's. Uh, oh goodness. Whoo! Not sure where we're at now, but uh, I want everyone at home just to be decent, stay decent. And if anyone's interested in some of this be decent stuff, I've been talking to my brother about uh, stepping out. It's a really cool story about it. If anyone wants to know, just call, hit me up. Uh, I'll give you some information. We have some local friends out here that do some search stuff. We can, uh, we can make some stuff. We can send it out, maybe. If I'm alive. Oh, man. You hit your two-minute mark. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm past two minutes. So, be tweet. <laughs> I can't even talk. Stay decent. I don't want to get a little twisted. I stop because of twist. I just love these things. And I've never done it before, but uh, if you keep it, if you like in my videos, 
go ahead and subscribe and like and throw my name out there. And I'll see you next time. Screw you, Josh.